in Colorado, and this weekend I get to be a part of something really special. Two teams consisting of middle school and high school students will be locked in the aerodrome of the middle school to circumnavigate the earth in two Redbird J simulators. I've been assigned to the red team. Time to go learn the flight plan and meet my crew. Hello. Hey, Brittany. <laughs> How are you? Good. Welcome to Aspen. Thank you. Yeah. You ready for 48 hours? Uh, yeah, yeah. Good answer. <laughs> Let's do this. Yeah. are going to be the first one to go, okay. but they are going to be the first one to load, because here's what you have to do. You've got to load on the runway, taxi off to the hold short line, then when you're at the hold short line, you load, okay? And then at that three minute mark, you'll be given the ATC instruction, clear for takeoff, and then you're right behind them, okay? All right, so we are going to go with my watch right here. Wait, Mr. Okay, can you help me with the timer? Somebody else hold, can. Hold. Yeah. Okay, verify. Which way are you going to taxi off? Left or right? Oh, we're going to go right. Okay. Right? Right. Where's your taxi diagram? How far do you have to taxi to get around? Shouldn't there have been one right here? Yeah, I thought so. I don't see it. This is, this is taking too long. A taxiway has not come up yet. Wait. You know. Where's your taxi guy? Where's your taxi guy? Where's your taxi guy? Two minutes and 15 seconds, people. Two minutes and 15 seconds. No, no, there's nothing here. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. There's a taxiway right there. That's the first 10 minute penalty. Two minutes. Mr. Strong, we're clear of the runway. We're going to need to back taxi so you can do a turn. Yeah, yeah. All right, you guys could have taken off 21 seconds ago. 21 seconds of 48 hours. Yeah, All your rotation speeds coming up by heading up zero nine four. What airspace are we in? Did you hear 20 minutes early? Five, four, three, Two, one, switch. So 44,000 is our altitude. So then, we also, on the red team now, this is so cool, Brittany Machalka. Brittany Machalka is here as well. Does this bother you when I do this? Does this mess you know, up? Does to it focus. mess up the thing? What do you do? How do you solve the problem? It looks like it's going to crash when we uh, pop those things down the road. Who's up? November 831 Alpha Alpha. Uh, say again, last, uh, last transmission? So, the way you read this is, that's their altitude, they're at 10,200 feet. All right, 10,370 knots? Yes. Okay. 831 Alpha Alpha, I'll read you loud and clear. How do you read that? November 850 Hotel Papa, cleared to land, runway 2 center, go red team. Isn't it like 10 PSI at sea level? I'm not sure. So here's what's happening. Right now, Red Team has just taken off here from Russia on their way over here across the Aleutians into Alaska. We had 374 nautical miles separating the two teams after 28 hours of flight. So if you're 40,000 feet, about 120 miles out, you want to start down, that, that'll be your best descent rate going in.
So okay. it's Sunday. You're 41 uh, hours yeah, in. Right. Hurt me. Yeah. How how are you feeling? Oh, come on. Oh, ow. <laughs> <laughs> this has been such an amazing program, and just this 48 hours that I've been here has been so fun. Because we should probably have enough fuel. Part of our program involves kind of two different things. Everything is tied to applied math and science. We didn't get to load an approach until like 20 nautical miles out. It's such a unique educational opportunity for kids. The cool thing about what we do here is that as you go through the ground school, as you learn to use this E6B, as you learn to do the calculations that our kids are doing right now here even in this flight challenge, mm -hmm. that's really the opportunity for them to apply what they learn right. in these math and science classes. You're doing insanely well with your course. Because if he just tickles the feathered edge of that candy cane of death, <laughs> He could sneak this sucker in there. No, they got it. They decided to descend to get a little bit more airspeed because they think they have just enough fuel. So, it's good. It's over. Black team wins. program is a great way to get teens to learn about math and science and have fun. I have no doubt that I've just met some future pilots that I look forward to sharing the sky with soon. Next, I'm off to California to focus on emergency procedures training.